Hi, welcome to my kitchen. Today I'm going to show you a very simple nutritious meal that you can make anytime. Um, this is going to be spaghetti squash. I get it from the store and I've already cut it so I'm just going to kind of walk you through what I did when I first got it. So when I got it, it was like this. Oops, I broke it up. One whole round, like a melon, but this is a spaghetti squash. It's really hard. The shell is hard so when you get it, you want to make sure that you are cutting it all the way through. You have a good knife. This is a very cheap one, I'll get some more. But have a good knife, cut it through. Once you cut it, we're gonna open it up. And then you'll see the insides. It'll be like this, doesn't look too exciting. Seeds in there and all that other good stuff. So what we're gonna do is put it onto um, a dish to put in the oven to cook. I have a Pyrex bowl here. It's actually a bit hot now. So I'll put it on there, lay it flat. And let you see. So you see, I just have it laying flat. And I'll put this in the oven, I'll put it on about 425, and I'll let it bake for about 35, 40 minutes, but I'll watch it until the inside of it get really soft, and then I can take the fork and string it. So this is your spaghetti squash. Give it a try if you haven't done it already, and you can top it up with some uh, pasta sauce or whatever sauce that you want to add on top of it, but treat it as if you would treat your regular pasta noodles, okay? So have fun with your spaghetti squash, and let me hear about it. I'd love to find out how you used it. Okay, thank Hello, you. Hello, welcome back. Okay, so the spaghetti squash is done. I'm gonna take it out. It's actually already out the oven, so I'm gonna bring it over here and show you how to shred it up really quickly. Okay, so we have it here on the table, and it's really, really hot, so I'm just going to flip this over. Ah, it's smoking hot. You can hardly see. I have to turn it so you can be able to see. Here's one that cooked. You can see how it cooked. I'll go quickly. I know everybody doesn't have much time. Okay, so you see that it's cooked through all the way. And what I'm going to do is just string it. So I'll take the seed part out, as much of the seeds out as possible. Uh, just dump it over here. Okay, I'll have to clean it up later. Okay, but you see it's starting to look stringy like our popular spaghetti noodles. <laughs> okay. So what, what we'll do is uh, continue to get this part out, the seeds. If you want to use the seeds, I'm sure there's a recipe where you can use the seeds. Oh, and speaking of recipe, I noticed on the label that I got it from, they actually give you some tips of some different recipes. So when you peel it off, make sure you read it and find out other ways that you can be able to uh, do this, okay? So I'm going to just take the um, squash and finish taking the seeds out of it. And then I'm going to just shred it. So take the pork and just shred it. And it comes into some nice noodles where we can be able to serve some pasta over it. Okay, so this is an example with our nice noodles. <laughs> okay, one moment. And we are all done. So this is an example with our nice noodles. And I can fix it up later, but my kids, I call it. <laughs> okay, till next time. I got to get dinner.